We return to that cold, cold thing. After a big fight, and uh, we have to be kind of careful. There's some things, uh, especially with the champion ascendant Grimgire. The horns of the Owl Ox here, and some pretty nice boots. The boots of the White. We already have them once, but I believe. Yeah, we'll also give them to Adonan. And yeah, they are, I think they're better for us than the Boots of Speed. A little bit of resolve just fits the thing better. But the horns of the Aurox, they're also pretty impressive. Winter's Touch. After it being hit or crit, the wearer's next successful weapon attack does 10% freeze damage. Sturdy as an ox, immune to push and pull effects. That would be something for Adonan, but he already has that thing. Which gives him resistance to resolve afflictions, which is just too great. On the other hand, Sturdy as an ox gives immunity to push and pull effects. What? An infamous Omawa raider came across a small ford of Abaddon's servants and slaughtered them at all, save one smith who hid amongst the crate of supplies. The dwarf called out to the Omawa. Offering an exchange, she would craft the finest helm the raider had ever seen if he would spare her life. The raider granted her one week and demanded that the armor honor his patron, the Beast of Winter, Rimmergand. The smith toiled endlessly until the last evening, when she set the helm just outside the forge's unbarred door. The helm was gone the following dawn, and the sanctum to Abaddon never plundered again. So it was kind of an honorable we have to be a little bit careful as there are traps here as you can see there's something else here that looks dangerous let me see right here be right there we should destroy that thing if we can the sigil of death that looks like it hurts yeah Let's give it the right treatment. We don't want to die, so let's destroy the sigil of death. And let's disarm that here. Where's the rest of us? Ooh. Ah, here we're standing. <laughs> Go and I just see. see. There. What did I tell you? Ah, beautiful. An amulet of greater health. Jewels. Look, there's something with this with this thing here. Uh, something more. Now, what is there? Is there something in here? Awakened wood and primal flame. Oh, there's something else. Another sigil of death. What in the name of? We need to remove that, or it will kill us, probably. Whoa! Watch and learn. That's pretty crazy here. Are there more of these sigils of death? Better be careful, eh? Right here. Leave it to me. What can we see? Hmm. Let's come here together. What is this? Mm. Colorful cloth. Whatever that is, it, it leads it look at that, it leads downward again. But where? Oh, does it lead here? Let's follow that. that it, f it gets down here. And then the next time it gets down to a, no, to a completely different part. Uh, 
That looks crazy, kind of. Mm -hmm. I think we need to try that out. A thick spike juts from the ice here. Someone has secured a rope to it and it dangles down the sheer face below. Test the rope. Oh, look at that. We are shocked and have a wrenched knee. Test the rope, though. It seems entirely secure. The rope itself is strong and the ice has formed around the grappling hood, freezing it in place. We'll descend the rope. You carefully make your way down the rope, feet only occasionally slipping across the frozen wall. A small cylindrical object protrudes from the wall. Oh, what is that? Swing closer to the object. Plant your feet, then push hard against the ice, swinging out towards the object. Adam seems to be an ice pick, its head frozen over, much like the grappling hook above. Hmm, let's try to reach out. You again push against the ice face with your feet. This time focusing your strength to propel you towards the pick. You reach out and grasp it. But it doesn't budge, leaving you suspended above the abyss. Who could pull it free? Let's try. Failure. Oh god. You cannot budge the rhyme rooted pick. Uh, let go of the handle. And we will uh, blast it free with an immolator. Oh. Carefully wedge it. Hand is still on the bomb when it goes off, engulfing you in flame and sending both you and the ice pick plummeting towards the floor below. You were injured, you hit the bottom half with a slick, sickening crack. Your leg gives out below you and everything goes dark. Oh God. As pain explodes through your head, your head swims as you come around to find yourself sitting on the ice floor. Your leg aches and warm sticky blood trickles from the side of your head. We're injured three times. Are we dead now? Are we dead now? What's happened there? Oh, something else has happened. Ah. Oh. There's something below. We have discovered something. Rhinebound. Well, we need to rest here. There's no. There's nothing. Nothing around that, right? Here we go. Um. So let's rest. We'll have some paloi nuts. To go nuts. It's dark and cold, but we ha we just had to rest, and we've been healed, thankfully. Oh, there's the ice pick too. Ha! I'll see it done. Got the ice pick, glacier bane. What is that? Oh, look at that. That's kind of blue. The hilt of this pickaxe is wrapped in layers of heavily worn cloth, each older than the last. Etched along the wooden grip are dozens of tiny pictograms, tales of Enutanic dwarves. From Nazitak, some of the carvings are neat and precise, others nearly indecipherable. They tell of long treks across frozen tundra, battles with massive beasts and snow-covered Ardra pillars. The most recent images depict an island of ice slowly expanding to the north of Nazitak. It is crushing and piercing. What is it? Is, is that a warhammer? It has 8 penetration. It is superb and serrated. It gives extra 10% damage. It's raw. Wow. It's a pretty good one. Mm. And I believe... I mean, we have the resounding call. That's a warhammer. As excep exceptional with 10 penetration. But we have that pick now. I have to compare to this one. Because we're also a warhammer specialist. And Glacier Bane. Apparently is a little bit better just a little bit but it's better we'll use that thing even though the cacophony isn't isn't too bad we'll lose glacier bane now b 
beautiful thing. Modware and Glacier Bane. What's waiting for us there now? Oh, that's kind of it's creepily glowing. Oh, there are rhyme constructs here. But do, do they damaged rhyme constructs? Hey, hi there. How do you do? Is everything fine? Yeah, indeed. That's us. Can we continue here? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So much for that. There's something ahead. We've discovered something. There's oh, there's there's the whoa, there's traps. There's a lot of traps. Yeah. They'll never know I'm here. I got this. I got this. Better be careful. Hmm? What's this? Oh. Beautiful. Traps, traps, traps. Right here. Easy does it. There's an right entrance there. to a cave. The <gasps> line constructs have been disabled, sister. Where are the frostbitten temple guards? Fuck the temple guards. Let us to the breach. The breach? And that was the breach. And they try to. According to Vatnir, a portal to into the white void has opened deep within the dead flow, fueling the iceberg's growth. If I'm to stop the spread of an endless winter, I should begin by locating this gateway into the beyond. The Vitmad. While Vatnir wasn't certain while the dead flow is spreading, he suggested that I begin my search at the Widman, an entrance to the beyond, hidden in a temple at the center of the icebound island. As I emerged from Harbinger's retreat, the dragon I'd killed returned to life. It seemed to be carried to the top of the iceberg by some unnatural force. Perhaps the creature, or whatever plucked it from Harbinger's watch, might know more about the Widman. While exploring the icebound temple, I witnessed a soul vision of people frozen here during some manner of attack. So that's the breach, and that's the temple. Leave it to me. That's really, really impressive. So there's the west cave, of the rhyme bound, rhyme bound, yeah, rimmer gun, rhyme bound. Is there something? Com Combined with this, wait, 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 wait. Consider it done. Hard to see this even. What a trap that was. Some steel hammers and chisels. Hey sure. Oh, and there's something hidden beneath this stone, maybe. Oh, nothing written, unfortunately. Is there more that we can find here? This beautiful land of ice. Oh. Not a sound. We could maybe follow the attack, really. And go to the west cave. That, that's the breach. Maybe that on the other side is not the breach. That could be something, right? So... Mm, let's look into that first. Surely something extremely dangerous here. Yeah. There's also Thanks a lot of me. traps. Hinting oh, to... Oh my goodness me! There's more of these strange pilgrims. Can we maybe disarm that? Give me a real challenge. Without them attacking us? 
Apparently, yes. They've been looking into another direction. Wow. Ah, so let's see. Let's see. Right here. We must be extremely careful. Um, let's make sure everyone got its got their right weapons. What is it? Hmm. Better have the defensive set up, right? Yes. Hmm? Indeed. We will have to fight this, and it's they're right before doing something here. I, I, I think, I think it's. I'm here. It's pretty creepy. Yes. Mm. Of course. Adonan will use the Frost Seeker. Certainly. Here we go. I'm no pack what can I do? Let's offload this junk. What can we do? We can start with a moon well that heals though. Mm. Dire Blessing is still a very good idea, so yeah. we'll use that. Hey there. Okay, Vasa. Pilgrim Savage will hopefully charge in. Of course. Bullseye. I got this. Well. What can we do with him? Well shoot. Bring them down. Oh, that was pretty successful, I'd say. All the reflections. go for a substantial phantom but we can also do something different wilting wind is also something pretty good to start with I think Just straight out of the blue That would be the best position, right? Here we go. Lord Paul will stay like this. Here we go. Everyone's coming in. Savage is coming as well. Ouch. And the surprises are coming. <laughs> Ouch. These strange rimmer gun cultists will hopefully be no match for us. They're clearly evil with their sigils of death. They have every reason to think they will try to kill us anyway. That's why we could attack here. We've also never loved rimmer gun. Always been one of the worst mm. slashing, really. Well, we will also slash. The bears are coming as well, not doing much. Uh, why are you not? Huh? We cannot access this. Well, and we'll guard the rear with, with Lord Paul. Yes. That's also a good thing to be in a position. We had the Wilting Wind. Could go for the Freezing Rake. Mm. Doesn't seem to be so great. 
two, fifteen, seventeen. Not fire. Not cold. Something different would be good. What is different from that? I mean, we can start with the chill fog. Why not? Let's, let's get that going. Kevava. Just like that. I'm here. And quarrel. Devotions. And what's coming from behind? Something big? Mm. Ow. One of them was healed. Hit you will hit you, Mr. Sworn Rival. Helping them from behind. Mm. Hurt you. Oh, that's the stuff. They're just breaking down strangely. Mm. Don't even know what they would do. Oh, well, that one's marked for the hunt. That one's close to death. Here we go. Still alive. I need something sharper. Maybe let them slicken? I don't know. Maybe the shadow flame is a good thing. Aha! There is a celebrant. Might be the ow the problem. Right hmm. here. Got this one was marked, but this one needs to go down. My here we pleasure. go. And that's how it's done. I'm here. I don't know. Mm. You know, sometimes a hit is a hit. I can only hope they cannot resurrect Ow. Then paralyzed. Ah, uh, we can do this. On to the companion. Give them a fireball. Ah, it's not the best, but I don't care. With well, better be careful. Yes. Quarrel. Go for the beautiful garden of healing. And I don't know. Ah, the bear. The bear went down. Looks 
like it hurt. Garden of life doing well. Another bear coming in. Yes. Bear, bear, I don't care. Oh well. Maybe another wilting wind, you know. At first, can sacrifice a bit, and now we could wilt again, or just go for the death ring. Yeah, the death ring is also fine. Let's go for the death ring. Hey there, Pilgrim. Ah, we cannot move. Ah, we cannot move anymore. No. Yes. Hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. As you wish. Take them out. Anyone marked for the hunt? This one. What a bullseye. On to the hero hunt. No, they're already all dead. That is so unfortunate. Charge! And he goes down. I'm here. What did these creepy people have with them? And he notes another horned helm. Interestingly, a mouth char. Superb leather armor. Scrolls, they are suddenly rich here. Rich, rich, rich. And we have to be extremely careful. There might be more traps. Hmm. This door could... There's probably a door here that can be opened, right? There's something in the next chamber. And we'll have a look at that in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Happy gaming to you. It's chill inside, it's cold, it's it's freezing. What will we find inside this, where apparently someone has made camp? See you in the next episode. Have a great time until then, and happy gaming. This is Manuel Khan, signing out.